Student Art Show kicks off this week at uh, Jackson Crossing, and yep. here to tell us more is Sarah Shirt, teacher at JPEG. Welcome. Thanks, Hi. guys. How good are morning. you? So really good, really good. Excited for the art show. Of yeah, course. I love the art show at the. Yeah. Jet. It's iconic. It is. It's such a nice annual event, and um, yeah. So this year we are really proud of the fact that we have more schools participating than we've had in many, many years. Oh, nice. We have 32 schools. What? Wow. Yep. Yep. Wow. 12 high schools, 10 middle schools, 10 elementary schools. Wow, that's fantastic. It that's, is. That's amazing. It's My, a lot of art. I, I I personally never had any art there. I, I know. You're no, you'd be surprised that I didn't. Shock, right? <laughs> uh, my daughter had a piece there once. Nice. There's that's nothing nice. better, right, than as a family going and watching, but the yeah. kids are so proud of their work, aren't they? They really are. Yeah. yeah, it's so nice to be able to celebrate their creativity and be able to let the community see what, you know, we've been working on and yeah all the just awesome different kinds of projects that kids are able to do throughout the county. It's great recognition for them and such yeah. a cool community event. So yeah, it absolutely tell is. our viewers where they can find the art show. Yeah, so it's going to be held at the Jackson Crossing. Um, it's a big show, so it's going to be pretty, you can't miss it. Okay, <laughs> all up and you down just the corridor. walk in anywhere in the mall and you'll see student art. Awesome. Yeah. So, um, um, mm -hmm. yeah, so what ages? You said 32 schools. So will we see schools. kindergarten up to high school? That's right. Awesome. Yeah. And there are awards given. Yes. How does that process work? Yeah. So um, we have 12 wonderful volunteer judges mm -hmm. this year. Nice. Yeah, it's a great diverse group. So it's really going to be um, so fortunate that the kids are going to be able to be recognized by a range of different perspectives mm -hmm. and acknowledged for all these different um, ways the art can be appreciated. So the judges will go around um, and award the pieces stickers. Okay. okay. So if you see a little like blue sticker next to a work of art, that indicates that that student has been awarded a first pr place prize. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Red stickers will be for second place. Okay. And yellow stickers will be for third place. Nice. Yeah. That's awesome. And once the show comes down, all of the teachers are going to be provided with a set of ribbons. Okay. And so the students will actually receive a ribbon. Aww, yeah. So fun. Yeah. And the ribbons are um, are very kindly produced by Brian Cooling oh, of nice. Cooling Creations yeah. in, um, in Hanover Horton. Cool. Oh, very cool. So yeah, he's been a great supporter of this whole endeavor. Oh, that's incredible. So lots of different mediums? Tons of different mediums. Yeah, let's take a look at some uh, yeah, we've some got of the paintings. Word. Beautiful paintings. Lots wow. of creativity and skill displayed here. It, That's beautiful. It amazes me oh, the, look at this. the talent that the that young kids possess. Yeah, yeah really incredible. It looks like digital art here. Yes, what a say, beautiful piece. Oh. It looks like some pen and ink work. Wow. Really beautiful. That's, um, it looks like Florence, Italy, they were studying. So Sarah, all the teachers I they select know. from their school or their class, mm -hmm. what pieces will go to the art show, correct? Yeah, that's right. Oh, um, art, I love that. That's yeah, cool. Yeah, um, I'm sure that the art teachers are having very similar experience um, that I've had. That's oh, this hard, is right? Shreya. This is one of my students at JPEC. Nice. With Look at that pottery. pottery. Yep. Look at that mug with the little rosettes on That's it. Cool. That's cool. Gorgeous. That so fun? Yes. Sarah, how hard is it to select uh, who is going? Oh, it's really yeah. hard. You want to include everybody. Right. Um, but, you know, it, I think it's just, it's so important for kids to feel like it. they don't have to be the, the best art right. student yeah. to be able to be included. Like, you know, all of this effort and all the creativity that the kids develop and display over the course of the year, we just want to lift them up and shine Very a little cool. light on them and yeah, are just there, celebrate the, the fun. Sarah, are there any special events that go along with the art show? There is, yeah. The Jackson Crossing has been a really incredible partner very much in support of this annual show. And this year they've arranged to have some local food trucks nice. and some there musicians come on the 20th <sighs> at 11 o'clock. So okay. if you guys are, anybody's interested. Oh, that'll be cool. Yeah, it'll be great. What we is are that, Friday? It's Friday? Yeah, we're... Uh, the 20th. I think Saturday. it's Saturday. 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 Mm -hmm. Saturday. We are the food truck capital of the United States, I think, at this <laughs> Feels point. Feels like we are. <laughs> Who doesn't love Petey's Donuts? Yeah. Oh my God, when they're right? fresh mm -hmm. out and hot. So good. Like yeah. Now, Addicted. Sarah, mm -hmm. are, are you an artist yourself? I mean, I dabble. So, yeah, as an art teacher, <laughs> yeah. I've, I've been known to make a piece or two. Was um, 
was there ever an opportunity when you were growing up to have your art on display like this? You know, there unfortunately there wasn't yeah. in my community, but um, that's okay. I mean, yeah. I think that we're very, very fortunate in Jackson to have this opportunity and like, yeah. It's, Speaking it's of fortunate in Jackson, you're mm -hmm. a teacher at JPAC and mm -hmm. that's such a cool uh, resource for the community and yeah. option for kids. You want to tell us a little bit about what's going on over there? Yeah, absolutely. So um, JPEG has been around for 10 years. Wow. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, eight years ago, I was hired in. We established the art program. It's been a wonderful adventure. Oh, I just awesome. can't say enough about um, the, the community. The school itself has this really beautiful um, community. We've got a lot of really sweet kids who go to our mm. school. Um, we offer free college. Mm -hmm. That's incredible. Right? And it's it's for anybody, anybody and everybody. Yeah. So is there um, room for more? Absolutely. Yeah, we we serve students grade six through we actually offer a thirteenth year. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um for kids who would like to to take a free year of college. Um so yeah. So you've been there eight years. So I've you've gotten to see years. people from start to finish. Talk yep. a little bit about what that's like, especially at a at awesome. a new school, right? Awesome. Yeah. I mean, you know, all teachers love their kids. Right. And so being able to help them develop the self-confidence to be able to enter into the college classroom and mm -hmm. um, make choices that really positively impact like what opportunities are available to them post high school. Yeah. It's just been mm -hmm. I'm so proud of our kids. We have one student. Oh, my gosh. You guys, I could just like Don't rattle off. She's I know. No, seriously. <laughs> so so I've worked with this one student since sixth grade and he's going to Kettering. Oh, which awesome. is just incredible. I mean, right. like we, I just am so proud of, of them. That's and, cool. Very yeah. cool. It's awesome. Yeah. To, awesome to hear uh, for sure. And I'm sure that the kids love having you. What, uh, what is the uh, art class working on right now? Or are you guys mm -hmm. focused uh, on the show? Yeah. So I have a bunch of different classes. We've got one, um, uh, it's a sculpture class and they're working on bust portraits. And then we're going to be moving into um, armature based, like, dynamic pose figure cool. sculptures yeah it's really fun um with our ceramics program we have just finished up there's a wonderful um event going on in the next couple of weeks um it is called the empty bowls fundraiser oh. and they're raising funds for um for kiddos who are in support or in need of support mm -hmm. um after transitioning out of foster care. Oh, okay. okay. And so our students have made a bunch of bowls that will be donated to this fundraiser. Oh, and nice. Very cool. Yeah, um, so we're, we're doing that. And okay. then um, we've got character design classes where the kids are working digitally and in traditional media oh. to explore, like, how do you create cool characters? Awesome. Very yeah. cool. Awesome. Good things happening. And uh, again, the art show is underway right now, so people can yes. go today. Yes, please go in and view and enjoy. It's it's been a labor of love for everybody, and we're just so proud to be able to like share this with our community. Awesome. Oh, that's awesome. It's at the uh, Jackson Crossing Mall now through mm -hmm. April 28th, and remember the food trucks and entertainment will be there on April 20th. Sarah Shirk from the Jackson County Student Art Show and teacher at JPEC. Thanks so much for being with yeah, us. Yeah, thanks, guys. More of the show right after this quick break.